What up, Weenie fam? We're taking Nari to Disneyland for her first time ever. Super excited to see how she would react to arguably one of the best theme parks in the world. Also nervous at the same time, but we made sure to come prepared with the essentials. Some intense research, this was the best packing list we could come up with. Don't worry though, if you forget anything, Disneyland has baby care centers where you can buy baby toiletries, formula, and more. They also have changing tables, nursing rooms, and private stalls for feeding. And of course, the real heroes of Disneyland are amazing mamas. You can never have too many moms. We found that the majority of Disneyland rides Nari can go on are located in Fantasy Island. Here's the list of rides that have no height restrictions. Right now we're going to be heading to It's a Small World and it's going to be Nari's first ride. We're going to see her reaction. Yay! Let's go! You ready for our first ride? Over there is that side. That side. Yeah! All right, Weenie fam, to avoid copyright, you'll be listening to me sing my rendition of It's a Small World. It's a small... Nah, just kidding. I'm not going to torture you guys with my singing. Throughout the whole boat ride, Nari was amazed by everything around her. She had so much fun. Definitely a great first ride for a one-year-old baby at Disneyland. There are almost 300 audio animatronic dolls on this ride representing children from every corner of the world. It was fun trying to spot our cultural backgrounds. <laughs> And is this song going to be stuck in my head for the rest of the day? Yes. Yes, it is. That's a 10 out of 10 for sure. What do you mean? 10 out of 10! <laughs> How'd you like your first ride, Nari? Oh, you love it, don't you? You want to go back on? Okay. After It's a Small World, we made a pit stop at one of the famous Disneyland churro stands to get a churro and made our way over to Tomorrowland for another ride that Nari can go on, Astro Blasters. Tomorrowland also has two other rides Nari can go on that have no height requirements. All right, Nari, let's see how you like Astro Blasters. You ready? Yay! This ride was way more interactive than I thought it would be. Nari couldn't hold the laser, but she had a lot of fun watching us shoot down Buzz Lightyear's arch enemy, Zerg. And to defeat Zerg, you just aim your fire laser at the Z targets. I highly recommend this ride for both parents and kids. Guys, look at this weather. We bought two ponchos today. They didn't even end up using it. Every time we come prepared, it doesn't happen. When we don't have it, it's going to pour. Guaranteed. Nari still had energy, so back to Fantasyland. We didn't know which ride to go on first, so we asked the evil queen from Snow White. Oh, I'm sorry. Is he trying to have me that? <laughs> All right, did she make it? What is your favorite ride? So of course we headed over to Snow White's Enchanted Wish. Oh. Oops, sorry, I meant the Evil Queen's Evil Wish. And she's out, sleeping just like Snow White while we're waiting in line for the ride. Every now and then she would keep waking up and going back to sleep, so we decided to stay in line in case she woke up again for the ride. We were wrong, she was so tired, not even the music during the whole ride could wake her up. Since she needed some rest, we decided to go grab a bite at Bengal Barbecue, located in Adventureland. And of course, like any true Asian, my mom brought her own food. Sorry guys, we were all so hungry, I forgot to take a video of the food before we ate it. We ate it all. It's gone. Luckily, Jeannie took a photo with all the delicious food we ate at Bengal Barbecue. So here's a quick snapshot of the foods we ate here, just in case you guys want to try these out yourself. I highly recommend the sliders. As we were walking off the carbs, Nari woke up again just in time to see Pluto right before we got to the hotel to rest. Hey guys, I know it's only 5.30, but we're all tired. Nari's tired. It's okay, we're gonna be back tonight. When we went back to see the light show at 9 p.m., it was raining like crazy. But luckily, we already had our Disneyland ponchos ready for action. Not only protecting us from the rain, but also our snacks. Bye-bye! Don't forget to like and subscribe to see more of our family vlogs. We'll see you next time, Weenie Fam.